Sepia. Example species belongs to the phylum Mollusca, class Cephalopoda and order Decapoda. Sepia is a marine mollusk commonly called cuttlefish. They do not contain an external shell but an internal shell is present which is completely covered by mantle. The shells of dead specimens are known as cuttle bones and they are used for polishing glasses. The body of sepia is divided into head and visceral hump and a distinct foot is absent in their body. A terminal mouth is present on their head, a pair of lateral eyes and five pairs of circum oral arms are present on their head. Their foot is modified as arms and these arms are provided with the suckers and they are mainly used for food collection. So they have five pairs of circum oral arms. Except the fourth pair of arm, all the arms are short and stout with longitudinal rows of suckers all along their inner surface. So they have five pairs of circum oral arms. Except the fourth pair, all the arms are stout and short with longitudinal rows of suckers all along their inner surface. So on the inner surface of all circum oral arms except the fourth pair, they contain suckers. But only on the fourth pair, they are long and slender and the suckers are present not at their inner surface but on the tip. So on the fourth pair, suckers are present only at their tip. Here you can see the suckers are present at the tip. And those arms are called the tentacular arms. In male sepia, the left tentacular arm has a spoon shaped tip called a hectocotylus or spadix and it acts as an intermittent organ for transferring sperm to female during mating. So in male sepia they contain a specialized spoon shaped tip called a hectocotylus or spadix for transferring sperm to female body during mating and this modification is called a hectocotylization. And the modified arm is called a hectocotylized arm which is present only in male sepia. The trunk region is covered by a thick and leathery mantle and the mantle has several lateral folds called a fins. And this fins aids in swimming. The mantle cavity communicates with the outside through a ventral tube called a siphon. And this siphon is a modified part of the food. And through this siphon, water passes in and out. Sepia has the ability to change its color. And this is possible with the help of pigment cells called chromatophores which are present in the body. There is an ink sac present in the body of sepia which opens to its rectum. And this gland secretes a dark colored ink rich in melanin pigment. When they encounter an enemy, they secrete this ink into surrounding water to escape from enemies. So ink gland and ink production is a defensive adaptation of sepia.